what's going on guys, it's Brian with Superman's Comics in collaboration with ComicBookInvest.com and in this video I'm going to give you my weekly picks for comics that are coming out Wednesday, December 12th, 2018. Christmas is upon us, a few weeks away, so this week let me help you make that list and check it twice for all the great comics that will be coming out. Kicking us off this week we have Batman Annual Number 3. In this issue we witness Batman's battle for justice but from Alfred's perspective and we learn how harrowing that journey has been as Batman experienced one of the worst nights Gotham City has ever seen. Batman Who Laughs number one, straight out of Dark Knight's metal, Batman Who Laughs is getting his own titled series. This guy have three different covers for it. There's a regular jock cover, regular price Greg Capullo variant, and a blank variant. There's gonna be a crap load of store exclusive variants out there as well, but these are the ones coming direct from the publisher. Detective Comics number 994. Commissioner Gordon calls in the Dark Knight Detective when there's a murder at the Gotham City Aquarium that's staged to look exactly like Thomas and Martha Wayne's crime scene, right down to the playbill and pearls. We have a regular cover. There's also a regular price variant by Mark Brooks. I'm picking up the Mark Brooks variant. Electric Warriors number two. The Planet Covenant is live. Warrior representatives from across the known galaxies have gathered to wage battle and prove their cosmic superiority. Representing the humans of Earth is Warcry, who enters into his first gladiatorial match with all the ego and bluster we can expect from Earthlings. Flash number 60, this is going to introduce us to a new Strength Force user and powerhouse. She's a young rebel using her powers to fight the corrupt police state in Coral Maltese. We have a regular Rafa Sandoval cover. There's also a regular price variant, which at first look might think it's Art Germ, but it's actually Derek Chu. I'm going with the regular cover on this because it actually has the new Strength Force user on the cover. Hawkman number seven. This issue is going to give us an origin of Hawkman. We have a regular Brian Hitch cover. There's also a regular price Tedesco variant. I'm going with the Tedesco cover. Justice League Dark number two. There's a mysterious infection called Kotard's Delusion that's spreading, trapping countless souls in the dreaming and leaving their physical bodies yearning for death. We have a regular Nicholas Scott cover. There's also a regular price variant by Clayton Crane. I like the Crane variant. New Talent Showcase 2018 number one. This has the latest graduates from DC's talent development workshops showing off their skills by telling stories about Batman, Catwoman, John Constantine, Wonder Woman, Zatanna, and more. Suicide Squad number 49. Beneath the ice of the Siberian Seas, there's a final reckoning that awaits the Suicide Squad. Amanda Wallace still has that brain bomb implanted in her head with Rick Flagg's finger on the trigger. We have a regular David Williams cover. There's also a regular price variant by Francesco Matina. I've been picking up the Matina covers on these. Titans number 31. There's a new leader of the Blood Cult and her name is Mother Blood. There's going to have a regular Clayton Henry cover as well as a regular priced Philip Tan variant. Wonder Woman number 60. Wonder Woman combats the resurrected God of War Ares. This is going to have a regular cover by Terry and Rachel Dotson, as well as a regular price variant by Jenny Friesen. Batman Dam number two. As Batman's descent into the madness of Gotham City's decadent underbelly continues, he must try to exercise some of his demons. There's a regular cover by Lee Bermejo. There's also a regular price variant by Jim Lee. I, I like the Bermejo cover. I know a lot of people like Jim Lee, but I love Bermejo's art. I've been loving this. Can't wait to pick this issue up, so I'm definitely going with the Bermejo cover. Goddess Mode number one. In a near future where humanity's needs are provided for by a godlike AI, it's one young woman's horrible job to do tech support on it. But Cassandra Price's life changes forever when she discovers a hidden digital world beneath our own, one where a group of superpower women are locked in a secret war for the cheat codes to reality. There's a regular cover by Robbie Rodriguez. There's also a gorgeous regular price variant by the artist I always mess up his name. Bitter Root number two. An evil force stalks the streets of Harlem as Berg and Colin face off against a deadly creature that may be more than they can handle. This has four different covers for it. There's a regular Sanford Green cover, regular price Bill Senkovitz variant, regular price Michael Cho variant, and a regular price Ashley Woods variant. I myself, I like the Senkovitz cover. Cemetery Beach number four. Force recon expert Mike Blackburn has promised to get dissident Grace Moody out of a secret private space colony and back to Earth to reveal what happened here a century ago. The oldest people in the colony are about to show they can still kill. We have a regular cover by Jason Howard. There's also a regular price impact variant by Jason Howard. 
Amazing Spider-Man number 11. Jonah Jameson has a new job as a shock jock. But is the world ready for pro Spider-Man Jonah Jameson? There's going to have four different covers for it. There's a regular Ryan Otley cover, regular price Gabriel De Otto Fantastic Four Villains variant, regular price Conan vs. Marvel Heroes variant by Giuseppe Comincoli, and an incentive Into the Spider-Verse animation variant. I like the animation variant. Look forward to that Spider-Verse movie, the animation, and it's fantastic. So I'm going to go for the animation variant. Avengers number 11. The Avengers organize an international superhero summit gathering heroes from the most powerful nations on Earth, but no one's expecting the shocking new representatives of the United States. We have a regular Ed McGinnis cover, regular price Alan Davis Fantastic Four Villains variant, and a regular price Conan vs. Marvel Heroes variant by Carlos Pacheco. Black Order number 2. The tables are turned as the Black Order goes to assassinate the Emperor. It's a good thing Black Order is made up of professional killers, who are no strangers to cell blocks. There's a regular cover by Philip Tan. There's also a regular price variant by John Tyler Christopher. Champions number 27. This brings the end to their mystic quest, but at what cost? There's a regular cover. There's also a regular price Marco Djurjevic Fantastic Four Villains variant, and a regular price Marvel Rising Action Doll Homage cover. Defenders Doctor Strange number one, and a desolate, Barren landscape, the master of the mystic arts fights what may well prove to be his final battle alone, unaided, and friendless. This has five different covers for it. There's a regular Ron Garney cover, regular price Scotty Young baby variant, there's an incentive Christian Ward variant, an incentive Mike McCone variant, and an incentive Steve Ditko remastered variant. Defender Silver Surfer number one falls to Silver Surfer who decides which planet will live and which will feed the unending hunger of the world-devouring Galactus. A single honest person can tip the balance if only Silver Surfer can find one in time. Five different covers for this is a regular Ron Garney cover, regular price Scotty Young Baby variant, 1 in 25 incentive Scon variant, there's a 1 in 50 incentive Pascal Ferry variant, and a 1 in 200 incentive John Basima Remastered variant. Fantastic Four Wedding Special Number 1. We celebrate the impending nuptials of the Thing and Alicia Master with the Ladies' Night Out as we go on Alicia's Bachelorette Party. There's going to have six different covers for it. There's a regular Carlos Pacheco cover, regular priced Pascual Ferry cover, regular priced Mike McComb variant, regular priced Art Germ variant, there's a regular priced Fantastic Four Villains variant, and a 1 in 25 incentive Marcos Martin variant. Miles Morales Spider-Man Number 1. Balancing his normal life, school, parents, etc., and superheroing has never been easy. But when the rhino and cadre of mysterious criminals start plaguing Brooklyn, things take a dark turn. This has got five different covers for it. There's a regular Brian Stelfreeze cover, regular price Marco Djurjevic Fantastic Four Villains variant, there's an Incentive Spider-Verse Animation variant, there's a 1 in 25 Incentive variant, and a 1 in 50 Incentive Elizabeth Torque variant. I like the Torque variant, I like Miles Morales, I like the movie coming out as I said earlier, so the 1 in 50 Torque variant is my pick of the week. Peter Parker Spectacular Spider-Man number 313. This is a Spider-Geddon tie-in, it's going to have two different covers for it, there's a regular Jeff DeCall cover, there's also a 1 in 10 incentive Spider-Verse animation variant. Spider-Force number 3, this is issue 3 of 3, it's a Spider-Geddon tie-in. The inheritor Verna will stop at nothing to get the Solace Crystal to bring her father back to life, and killing all the Spider Force would be icing on the cake. Just has one cover, and it's by Shane Davis. Spider Gwen Ghost Spider number three. As Spider Gwen rages on, Gwen Stacy of Earth 65 comes face to face with one of her deadliest opponents yet, the Gwen Goblin. We have a regular cover by Bengal. There's also a regular price Fantastic Four Villains variant by Carlos Pacheco. Typhoid Fever Iron Fist number one. Typhoid Mary is stronger than ever, and Spider-Man and the X-Men know that better than anyone as they've been forced to fight among themselves. Luckily, Iron Fist is in town and willing to lend a fist. We have three different covers for this. There's a regular RB Silva cover, regular price connecting variant by Gerardo Sandoval, and a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Afu Chan. Weapon X number 27. This is Weapons of Self-Destruction. Two roads diverge in a blood-soaked wood, for a time, Sabretooth took the one less traveled, but in this issue, he pays for it. It's got one cover, it's a gorgeous cover by Raza. 
X-23 number 7. This kicks off a brand new arc, a series of gruesome murders, and a killer who disappears without a trace. Laura and Gabby are on the hunt, but when Laura comes face to face with the mysterious ex-assassin, nothing is as it seems. There's a regular Ashley Winter cover. It's also a regular price variant by Mike Diodato. Mega Ghost number 1. This comes from Albatross Funny Books. Can life get any weirder for junior occultist Martin Magus? Living in the haunted city of Dunwich Heights is strange enough for a kid investigating the unknown, but when he comes into possession of a bewitched wing, he discovers that he now has the power to summon Mega Ghost, a giant supernatural robot sworn to defend the world against the creepy things that go smash in the night. We have a regular Gideon Kindle cover. There's also a limited variant by Eric Powell. So there it is, guys. Those are my picks for new comics that are coming out Wednesday, December 12th, 2018. Comment down below. Let me know what books you guys are picking up. This is Brian with Superman's Comics in collaboration with comicbookinvest.com. And I'll see you guys next week.